Hello, I am Miss Veronica with Jefferson County Public Library. Welcome to our toddler story time. We are going to have so much fun today. We're going to have some songs and stories and rhymes, all sorts of fun activities. And the best way to start our story time is if you're happy and you know it, that's a good way to start our day. So let's get ready to sing that. Remember, in if you're happy and you know it, you're going to clap your hands, you're going to stomp those feet, and you're going to shout hooray. And you can do it sitting down, or you could stand up and really go to town doing all of that. So let's start. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Clap, clap, stomp, stomp, hooray! If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Clap, clap, stomp, stomp, hooray! If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Clap, clap, stomp, stomp, hooray! Oh, excellent! That's such a fun song. Oh my goodness. Well, our theme today is going to be cookies. You see, we've got some cookies here and some little friends that are going to help us. And I have another friend, a very special friend, that's going to help us with our cookie story time. Now, this special friend is Blue. And this special friend loves cookies. And this special friend, oh, he popped right up. Did you see him? He lives on Sesame Street. Do you know now who I'm talking about? Oh, yes, it's Cookie Monster. Cookie Monster, hello, cookies, cookies. Well, Cookie Monster, we do have a bunch of cookies. Oh, look at that. Cookie Monster's waving hello to everybody. Oh, that's such a nice thing to do. Well, Cookie Monster, we're going to have some fun times with cookies, so maybe you could help us, okay? Oh, yes, 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 yes. Cookie Monster wants to help us. Well, we have a book here, and this book is called... Oh, now, we're not going to take a bite out of the book, Cookie Monster. Oh, you're just helping to hold it? Oh, okay. You're just helping to hold it. And maybe if you get a little taste of a cookie, that's not so bad. Well, all right. Now, this book is called If You Give a Mouse a Cookie, and it was written by Laura Joff Numeroff, and the pictures were done by Felicia Bond. This book was published by HarperCollins, and it's a fun book. Maybe you happen to have this book at home. It's a fun one to read because you've got a little mouse, a little mouse, that comes to visit, and that mouse, you give that mouse a cookie, well, then what happens next? Well, all sorts of funny things tend to happen after you give a mouse a cookie. Then that mouse wants some other things, too. So it's a fun book. I hope you get to read that sometime and enjoy it. It's a great way to, to have a, a little story time of your own. Now, Cookie Monster, you might have noticed that we have um, some cookies over here. Do you see those cookies? Yep, yep, we've got some cookies. And let's count those cookies together, shall we? I bet Cookie Monster would be good at counting, and you can help us count too. But we've got one, two, three, four, five cookies. Five cookies. Could I see five fingers from you? Follow, hold up five fingers. That's it. Five cookies. And then let's see what colors we have here too. Can you point to the red cookie? Can you point? That's right, that's the red cookie. Well, what about the orange cookie? Can you find that orange cookie? Yep, that's orange. Well, let's see, what other colors should we find? What about yellow? Are you good at finding yellow? Can you point to the yellow? There it is, there's our yellow cookie. What about blue? Now, Cookie Monster is very good at finding blue because, of course, Cookie Monster is blue, right? There it is. There's our blue cookie. And what color is left? What color did we forget? You're right. That's our green cookie. 
that's a green cookie. Well, I have a little rhyme, and we're going to talk about these, these little cookies just a bit more. Five little cookies with frosting galore. Mother ate the blue one. Then there were four. Four little cookies, two and two, you see. Father ate the green one. There it is. Now there are three. Shall we check? Let's check and make sure there's really three. Let's count. One, two, three. Yep, there's really three cookies. Three little cookies. Before I knew, brother ate the yellow one. Then there were two. Two little cookies. Oh, what fun. Uh, Sister ate the red one. Oh, and now there's only one. One little cookie. Watch me run. Oh, I ate the orange. Nom, 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 nom. And then there were none. Oh, that's a fun thing. I'm going to put our cookies right back up here because they're just fun. They're just fun to see. All right. Now, we are going to be cookies ourselves now. Are you ready to be a cookie? We're going to be chocolate chip cookies because that's just delicious. Do you help? Do you help make cookies at home sometimes? Yeah, that's a really fun thing to do. All right. Five yummy cookies, all chocolate chip. We're sitting in the cookie jar when the table tipped tip right over. And you know what? If you um, stand up, you could even tip right over and fall down on the floor. That would be a goofy, fun thing to do, wouldn't it? All right, let's start again. Five yummy cookies, all chocolate chip. We're sitting in the cookie jar when the table tipped. <gasps> One cookie crumbled. How many were left? Four. Four little cookies, all chocolate chip. We're sitting in the cookie jar when the table tipped. <gasps> One cookie crumbled. How many were left? Three. Three little cookies, all chocolate chip. We're sitting in the cookie jar when the table tipped. <gasps> One cookie crumbled. How many were left? Two. Two little cookies all chocolate chip. We're sitting in the cookie jar when the table tipped. One cookie crumbled. How many were left? <gasps> One. One little cookie, all chocolate chip, was sitting in the cookie jar when the table tipped. <gasps> that cookie crumbled. How many were left? Zero. No more cookies. Cookies all crumbled up. Yay! And you know when we count, when we count like that or count down and use it counting in rhymes, all of those things help develop our math skills and our um, sequencing skills. And you know sequencing, that just means going in order. Your grown-ups know all about that. So it's a fun thing for us to do to help our brains to grow. Oh, excellent. Let's see what's next. Well, it is time to be a little mouse with our finger. So can you get your finger ready? Get your finger ready. There's your mouse. This is going to be the hole that the little mouse lives in, okay? We're going to do this. Here's our little mousey. It's going to peek through the hole. We're going to peek to the left. We're going to peek to the right. And then we're going to pull back in because there's a cat in sight. And you know a cat likes to chase a mouse for sure. So let's try that. Here's our little mousey peeking through the hole. Peeks to the left, peeks to the right, then pull back in. There's a cat in sight. All right, one more time. Here's our little mouse. Here's our little mousey peeking through the hole. Peek to the left, peek to the right, then pull back in. There's a cat in sight. Oh, well done. Well, next we need to take care of something that Cookie Monster is thinking about. Cookie Monster wonders if we should get some more cookies. Would you like to go get some more cookies? Mm -hmm. Want to go to town? We'll go to town 
and we'll get some more cookies. Would that make you happy? Oh, well, we're going to do that. Cookies, cookies. We'll do that. When we go to town to get some cookies, we might just meet some friends along the way. So you get ready. When we meet these friends, we're going to meet a cow and a pig and some dogs. And we're going to need to make those dog and cow and pig sounds, too. Can you do that with me? Oh, yes, 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 yes. We'll do that. I took a walk to town one day and met a cow along the way. What do you think that cow did say? Moo, moo, moo. Mm -hmm. I took a walk to town one day and met a pig along the way. What do you think that pig did say? Oink, 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 oink. Oh yes, I took a walk to town one day and met three dogs along the way. What do you think those dogs did say? Woof, 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 woof. Yes, they did. Oh, we did it. We went to town, we met some friends, and we got lots of cookies. Yay! Well, now it's time for us to do patty cake. But you know, instead of doing patty cake and making a cake, we are going to make a cookie. Are you ready to do this with me? Patty cake, patty cake, baker's man. Bake me a cookie as fast as you can. Roll it and smash it and mark it with a C. Then put it in the oven for Cookie Monster and me. Yay! Yay, yay, yay. Oh, that's a fun thing to do. Now, you know, you can make a cookie to play with. Did you know that? You can make a cookie out of a paper plate. If you don't have a paper plate, just get a piece of paper and draw a circle. And then you can decorate it with your crayons or your markers. You can cut little bits of paper to make sprinkles on your cookie. And you can decorate a fun cookie that you can then play with. You could do that right there at home. Now there's something that you probably already know about. This is um, A Thousand Books Before Kindergarten. And this uh, is a program through the library. You just go to our website and sign up. It's all free. And you can mark down all those books that you're busy reading. You can mark in a circle every time you read a book. And then you get prizes all along the way. Bring that into the library. And you can get stickers. And you can get book bags. And you can even get a free book at the very end after you've read a thousand books, which you're easy breezy doing that, I know. Well, we should sing our alphabet song. Should we get Cookie Monster to help us with our alphabet song? That would be a good idea. We'll do that. Well, oh, you're not Cookie Monster. Well, did you really want to help us with our alphabet song? Is that what's happening? Okay. Well, all right, Miss Cow, you can help us with our ABCs. Are we ready? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time won't you sing with me? Yay! Yay, 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 yay! Oh, we are good at singing that alphabet song. Thank you, Miss, Miss Cow, for helping us with our song. Very nice. Oh, our story time is done. It's time for us to say goodbye. So we're going to sing um, our little goodbye song, and then we'll see you next time. Our story time is done. Our story time is done. Now it's time to say goodbye, because story time is done. Our story time is done. Our story time is done. Now it's time to say goodbye, because story time is done. Bye. See you next time.